like the ocean and it's so nice to have it close by, you know, all the time. I really do a lot of thinking. I'm that kind of person. Sometimes I feel too much, you know, and I get angry easily and I get sad and happy easily as well, you know, so... So, of course, it's a nice place to be at when you need to relax and you need to, you know, clear your mind. I am the, the first female from Sweden that have signed with the, with the UFC. Being the, the main event against Chris Cyborg for the first fight, it's, you know, it's a dream come true. It's the, the biggest thing that you can do and I'm really, really grateful for it. I'm fighting at the Red Line Training Center in Malmö, Sweden. And my head coach is Akira Karasan. He knows my opponent. He was training with Chris Cyborg. So, you know, he knows her both mentally and he knows her style as well. He has taught me a lot, actually. The wrestling that I didn't have before in the same way. The biggest change is from Muay Thai is definitely the, the footwork and you know to be able to defend takedowns. Super strong wrestler and grappler, just picked everything up pretty quick. And besides that, she's been in the business for a long, long time, coming as a two time world champion in the most competitive organization in Muay Thai and fighting at the highest level. Cyborg is in for a trick. I know that I have a lot of technical skills that she will have to deal with. This is a real big challenge and I'm so ready for it. I always have a lot of respect for all my opponents. Just getting into the octagon, you know, is huge respect for me. But I'm not always that nice. I do really like to hurt people as well. Oh, the big elbow to the face! I do think that the UFC fans really will enjoy seeing me give Chris Cyborg a hard time, you know, giving her some cuts and making her bleed.